wanted a nickname, a place you could go where people would say, hey, I know you, you're so and so, hey, that's such and such. They recognize his name and it meant so much. Just a nickname, a place you could go where people would say, hey, I know you, you're so and so, hey, that's such and such. They recognize his name and it meant so much. In 89, little Mike used to follow Rick the Ruler. He sold a little Buddha, he bought a little scooter. All the girls in the high school said it made him cuter. Fellas showed him love, I guess it made him cooler. His older brother schooled him, but he still needed a tutor. In love with the streets, he heavily pursued her. 1990 came and grew into a cougar, she got ruder. It turned little Mike from a fighter to a shooter. He had two friends for which he really felt trust. We all grew up together, but they ain't hang with us. One night they out chillin', they done got into a scuff. Little Mike sprayed around, laid some kid down. With everyone around, police caught when took Lil Mike in, asked him what happened. He ain't even try to pretend. He said, Where do I begin? Took the pen, blamed his friend, got him 20 with a 10. The moral of this story is self explanatory. It's easier being self than being somebody else. When little Mike hit his verse, probably gonna be upset. 20 years of regret. And what did he, he get? Just a nickname. Nickname. A place he could go where people would say, Hey, I know you. You're so and so, hey, that's such and such. They recognize his name and it meant so much. That's the nickname of place he could go. Where people would say, hey, I know you. You're so and so, hey, yeah. that's such and such. They recognize his name and it meant so much. Now, Jimmy's 16, going on 20 and such. She want a model, but she thinks she ain't skinny enough. Got that disease where she looks in the mirror, displeased with who she sees. Thinks she's fat, but nobody agrees. So, Hustle Man told her that her body was rocking, but she slimmed down if she just tried some Oxycontin. She figured she would try it, it'd be a hell of a diet. Enhance her social skills, she'd be a regular ride. She went broke, but she was too addicted to kick it. Hustle Man, that little cricket, wanted to give her the bitch. She'd do anything to get it, she let Hustle Man hit it He was infected with the magic, he specialized in tricking Now you see her with him when he cruising the town Her self-esteem high cause she losing some pounds Her friends question why she had him hanging around She figured they was jealous, she was gaining some ground She came down with a sickness she didn't understand To the doctor she ran for the final exam Dr. Craig Mack put the sad flavor in her ear Dear, you won't be around next year She reflected on the life she tried Realized to satisfy her appetite, she should have swallowed some pride. Felt bad for Jenny, sympathized inside. But she finally got her wish, she was skinny when she died. The moral of this story is self explanatory. Be happy with what you got, who you are, and who you're not. Social acceptance is hot on the way to the top. But on the way back down, you say it never meant a lot. Just a nickname, a place you could go. Where people would say, Hey, I know you, you're so and so. Hey, that's such and such. They recognize her name and it meant so much Just a nickname of where she could go Where people would say, hey, I know you You're so and so, hey, that's such and such Tony wasn't a bad person, except that he was nurtured through alcohol, drug dealing, and cursing. Parents used to find any reason to mistreat him, send him off to school, and that's where he get even. Let nobody close to him, ADHD, they diagnosed him, labeled him a bully, never understood him fully. And Ryan was a nerd jar from the burb jar, never ever broke a law, even curbed his dog. And he took his studies serious, his girl was a virgin, a virgin, neither of them ever missed a period. When Tony met Ryan, sparks started flying. Tony pushed him to the ground, and Ryan started crying. But the day before, Ryan found out his dad was dying. To hold it all together, he was trying. I ain't lying, but he was just a man. And Tony was the straw that the camel couldn't stand. I'm sure we understand why he jumped up, punched him. Couldn't no one stop him when he usually had his guitar. Today there was a chopper, so he cocked it. Popped, hit him with the full 11. And you could see his spirit flying off the bully heaven. The moral of this story is self -explanatory. Explanatory before you judge someone else. First off, for the help, I feel for Mike, Ryan, Tony, Jenny, and all. But then I look around, I see so many they more just on a nickname. nickname. A place they could go where people would say, Hey, I know you, you're so and so. Hey, that's such and such. They recognize their names and it meant so much. Just a nickname. A place they could go where people would say, Hey, I know you, you're so and so. Hey, that's such and such. They recognize their names and it meant so much, just a nickname.